We're expecting you tomorrow. No, I can't go that soon. Well, we're getting there tomorrow. We're leaving tonight. So uh, we've not even got a full day? You best get packing. L Lydia will help you when she's got Mr. Kids parking. I need to go out, actually. Hey, th that's not in the plan. Yeah, just to Mandy's, I'm going to borrow a suitcase. I won't be long. I'll come with you. No, no, you, you need to work on the van. Make sure it doesn't break down. I'm not going to be long. OK. Pre-flight checks it is, then. Thank you. Both of you for everything. minute to spare. Living dangerously, Belle. What do you want? A cup of tea and then a wash, because I keep finding these clumps of dried blood in my... You told me that I had to come. Did I? Oh, yeah. I phoned you. It's time to make a deal. Why haven't you told the police what's happened yet? How do you know I haven't already? Oh. Oh. <sighs> You've not done a statement or else I'd know about it. I didn't say I had, Belle. <laughs> You're not listening again. When I do, when I tell the police that my memory's crystal clear, I'm going to relive the whole trauma. Amelia's already told them that it was you. You locked me in. You beat me. You stuck an axe in my back. You were going to kill me. And here you go again. Round and round the same old loop. No. Here's the thing, Belle. I'm not actually going to tell the police that it was you who attacked me in your most psychotic act yet. If you drop your ludicrous, unsubstantiated allegations. What? Stop lying that I'm an abuser and you're in the clear. Well? I've said I need to think. Because it's a lie, Tom. Yes, I attacked you, but it was self-defense, and that's all I need to tell the police. Self-defense? The axe was in my back. How does that work? And just look at your history. One murder conviction already. Gemma was manslaughter. <sighs> You've been sectioned. How many times? You relapsed when you're stressed. You forget to take your meds. You hear voices. I can manage my mental health. I've got it under control. It's been the bane of our entire marriage, Belle. Your family are well aware of how I've struggled. No, that's what you told them. They know that that's not true. They'd be called as witnesses, my witnesses, to court, Belle, not yours. And then we've also got Marlon. Rona and Vanessa all taking the stand to describe how you viciously assaulted me in the street. Are you sure you're ready for that? Or we do as I suggest. I want you to be happy, Belle. Go and get some treatment, and you could have a whole future ahead of you. That makes sense. It'll be the last thing I ever ask of you. I'll do what you want. To seal the deal. Memory's a lot clearer now, and I'm ready to talk properly. We've just arrived, Mr. King. We'll take things nice and slowly. I'm 
So, um, in your own words, just tell me what you can remember about the alleged attack. Okay, um, I was walking, leaving the village, and then these two men just, just appeared. They were trying to rob me. They were asking for my money. What men? Did you recognise them? Mr King. I'd never seen them before. One was in his 30s. He had... He had a tattoo on his neck and a Leeds accent. And the other? 40s. He was thin. And he had these really dark eyes just... just staring back at me. They were right up in my face. I couldn't get past them, so I told them to get back. I shouted. I was so scared. And then the older one, he opened up his jacket and there was this axe. The axe. Oh, God. I ran, but they grabbed me. I broke free. And then there was this pain, this, this Red hot agony just spreading across my shoulders. This is horrific. He needs a rest. Have you got enough to go on? For now. If you can think of any more details, however small, I'll call you. I don't want anyone else to go through what I have. Thank you. I. I thought it was Belle. She might not be her best self right now, but. To put an axe in my back. Jimmy. All right, miss. Are you waiting for someone? What's this? Evidence. I've attacked my husband in self-defense. He wanted to kill me. I'm a victim of domestic abuse. <laughs> 